God bless everybody. God bless everybody. You are tuning in to the Join Force International dot org internet radio station. For those who are watching us, you're watching us on the DJ One TV on Bambooza dot com. I want to say God bless to my wife, my baby Daniel. Who's coming soon to my daughter Malini? I love you. I love you all. To my mother, I love you, mom. To my son, Justin, love you. To my pastors, which are my brother in law and my sister, Ramon Crespo and Diana Crespo. They are the pastors of. La Casa de Fe, Jaiwe Jire, located on 104 Suffolk Street in Holyoke, Massachusetts. Our P.O. Box is P.O. Box 583, Holyoke, Massachusetts, 01041. Big, big God bless you to David Silva. David Jr. and his wife Lisette. They have another baby, right? What's the other one called? Jashida. God bless to Jashida too. May the Lord bless you and the family. David Silva and his family is the proud owners of the Joint Force Family Network, which is on a uh, Roku Player. The name of the ch- uh, the name of the channel is called. Uniendo Fuerzas Internacionalmente. Let's see. Uh, God bless to Sister Rebecca and her children. We love you. God bless to Cito. God bless to Cito and Esteban. And to Jeremy and Louis and Gabrielle and Heriel, her son. And... Uh, Rebecca's nephew, what's his name? Nitro. God bless you. We love you. Let's go into a prayer and then we'll work it from there. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Lord, we thank you for another relaxed program, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for everything that you do for us, Lord. I pray for my wife, my baby, my big baby, my son, that you may bless them, Lord. I pray for my mother. I pray for my pastors. I pray, Lord, for Sister Rebecca, that you may bless her and her family and her nephew, and that her children and her may reunite. I pray, Lord, for Roberto and his family, his children. I pray, Lord, for Angel, Lord, that you may bless him. I pray, Lord, a special prayer for Maria Lepkowski, that you may heal the Lord from her health problem, Lord Jesus, that you may bless her, Lord. Pray for her family, Lord, that they may be saved, Lord. Pray, Lord, big, big prayer for the David Silver family, Lord, that you may bless each and every one of them, Lord. I pray, Lord, for the Marty family, for the Vega family, for the Vargas family, for the Santiago family, the Torres family. I pray, Lord, for each and every person that listens to the program on the internet radio and for those who watch us on the internet TV station. I ask you these things, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, today's another special Friday. Why is it special? Because today's Friday. So, yeah. <laughs> um, We're going to go with a commercial and we will be 
right back. Dios los bendiga, hermanos. Esta es su hermana y amiga Verónica Torres para invitarles a su programa Veré Vida Eterna, Relación y Evangelización todos los lunes de 9 a 10 de la noche a través de su emisora Radio Faro de Luz punto net. Radio Faro de Luz Cuando me miro al espejo, veo tus rasgos, veo tus reflejos. Mamá se sorprende de lo mucho que me asemejo. A ti, querido ser que siempre te mantienes lejos y que solo envías cartas cuando otro año festejo. Sé que trabajas mucho y por eso no me quejo, aunque en ocasiones me hacen falta los consejos. Pues he tenido dudas en temas que son complejos y como voy creciendo no sé cómo los manejo. No sé qué decidir, pero mamá se ha esforzado en enseñarme bien para no andar equivocado. Honestamente no sé cuánto tiempo haya pasado. Desde que no te veo, ¿por qué no me has visitado? Hace días me dijiste que vendrías a buscarme Estaba muy contento, qué forma de ilusionarme Tenía planeado correr hasta ti para abrazarte Pero me quedé dormido porque tú nunca llegaste ¿Dónde estabas? ¿Será que fue la misma situación? Cuando me quedé esperando en mi primera graduación Cuando estuve enfermo esperando ni pasaban horas Pero no, nunca llegaste Mi madre se quedó sola y aturdida Pero ella nunca se da por vencida Prefiero no comer para que yo tenga comida Y no sé si escuché bien la otra vez que tú llamaste Cuando mamá te decía ¿Por qué nos abandonaste? Que no fui planeado, solo el resultado de un error Pero siempre piensa que llevo tu sangre y tu color Que quizás fue un accidente, pero necesito amor Sí, sé que te esfuerzas y tratas de suplirme Todo lo que necesito para comer y vestirme Pero no sé si entiendes cuál es mi necesidad Que no es la mensualidad, sino tu paternidad Tu cariño, tu afecto, tu regaño, el incorrecto Yo sé que no eres perfecto y que tienes tus defectos Pero te fuiste cuando yo llegué y me disculpas Pero no pedí llegar, ¿acaso tuve la culpa? Yo quería ver a ti jugar conmigo en el canasto Se supone que eras tú y que no fueras un padrastro Termino esta llamada y antes de mi despedida Te doy gracias por ser vida de mi vida Si te amo, te busco y no tengo tu atención ¿Dónde estás?
hijo, es una gran bendición que muchos quisieran tener, pero no todos pueden. Tú que fuiste parte de esa gran bendición, aprovecha el tiempo e instruyelo en el camino correcto, tomando como ejemplo al mejor padre del mundo, Dios. And we are back from that video. ¿Dónde estás? What we gonna do right here, right now, is read. Let's see what we have. We have the book of Limitations, chapter 3, verse 26. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. It is good that a man should both hope and quietly wait for the salvation of the Lord. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for your beautiful words, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for one more day of life. And I pray, Lord, for each and a person who's listening, Lord, or watching and watching, that they may be saved today, Lord. I ask you these things, Lord, in Yeshua's name. Amen. Salvation. We've now been talking about salvation for the last three Fridays. Salvation is very important. Salvation is what's going to help you get through your depression, your anger, anything and everything that you're going through. But it's up to you to accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior. Yeshua, you call him by that name, he really enjoys it very much when you call him by his name. Salvation is very important. Because salvation will solve all your problems. Salvation. <laughs> it's an awesome word. Salvation means that you've been given a chance to repent for your sins. And for those who don't know, had Yahshua, those who know him as Jesus, had not been sent down from his father, Yahweh, to die for our sins, no matter what we did, If he wouldn't have got on got on the cross and and died and and came back and resurrected in three days, we would all be in trouble right now. There would be no salvation without that sacrifice, we would be lost. That means you would live in this world and you do whatever you think is the right thing to do, and then you wind up in a place that you don't want to wind up being in, which is the reason why the Lord keeps speaking to you every Friday. Praise break. I love praise break. I love the program. I love the music. But if there's anything I love is to have the chance to speak to each and every person that's listening and watching the program. Had the Lord not sacrificed himself no matter what we did, we would wind up in hell. And I'm not asking for anyone to open up their imagination. This is a real world with real things, heaven or hell. We're coming very close to the rapture. This is the time to prepare yourself to accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior. 
This is the time. Today is the day for you to accept the Lord as your Savior. We're not promised tomorrow. You're not promised tomorrow. I'm not promised tomorrow. But I will make it my business to, before I go to sleep, ask the Lord for forgiveness because we sin all the time. And although we are Christians, and those Christians that are listening, it's time for you to wake up too. It is the time where so many things are happening in this world. Everything is so real. I mean, who would ever think <laughs> that I'd be on this microphone right now preaching? You know the world has got to be changing. It's un unbelievable. It's a great feeling that the Lord uses me so that he can preach to you, talk to you, you that listen every Friday, you that really, really want to accept him as your Savior. And he keeps knocking on your door. And he doesn't get tired until you finally decide that you don't want to accept him as your Savior. He'll keep knocking on your door and keep knocking on your door. That's awesome that someone can love us that much. And I'm more than sure that there's no one in this world has, that has ever experienced love like that. It's wonderful. It's a great feeling. It means that if you're used to being in the world by yourself, there's so much love there that you wouldn't even know that you were by yourself with the Lord. You would, you would, you would feel like you're with a whole family knowing the Lord, being part of his family. Each and every one of us are brothers and sisters. And Yahshua is our Father. And Yahweh, our Father. Every time I get close to a Friday, I may get nervous for like maybe three minutes. And... After that, it's so awesome just to to be able to tell you about the Lord. Tell you how much he has changed my life. The person who always was by himself, doing things by myself. Very egoistic. Proud of things that were silly. And he taught me to love better than I've ever loved in my life. We have a tendency of saying, you know, we love this person, we love that person. But the love from the Lord is so different. To love and to be loved by Yeshua is 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 just amazing i've um i remember one time i wasn't i wasn't in the things of the lord yet i was living in new york and um my mother's my mother rosemary santiago she's been in the lord i believe for like 35 years and this was like a couple of years back. And I remember I had no money in my pocket. And I wanted to look for work. I wanted to do something. And I was talking to my mom. And my mother was like, because my, my mother's very, she's happy all the time. Even if she's having the worst day, you know, she praises the Lord. She She goes forward. And we were talking, <laughs> and the most amazing thing happened. As I was walking down the street, 
What did I find on the floor in New York? A twenty no, a twenty I think a twenty dollar bill. So that I would be able to get on the train and go wherever it was that I had to go. How amazing is that? I just finished speaking to my mom, telling her what I needed, how I needed it, and the Lord loved me so much that he said, here, go ahead and do what it is that you say you're going to do. Here you go. That's like a blessing, a blessing. A lot of people have a tendency of calling it this other word. I think they call it luck or something like that. <laughs> and there is really no such thing as luck. Unfortunately, the word luck and lucky only come to those who needed to the replace the truth that the Lord is always watching over us, always there for us. Something good happens, it's the Lord. Something bad happens, it's our flesh. And we blame it on the Lord, but it doesn't go that way. And I believe that the Lord will keep repeating that to you so that you can understand that we live in this world, in a world of flesh, where things happen. And the things that do happen, the bad things, are from our choices. Or the bad things that happen to us is from the choice of the person that wanted to do the bad. So it's time for you to stop blaming God because your life is not going right. It's time for you to take responsibility and know God so that you can have a one-on-one -on -one conversation on God, you know, these certain things, they happen. I don't want to question you, but, you know, I need I need some guidance. That's what the Lord is for. He's, he's our Father. He has the answers to all the questions. It's, <laughs> it's a great feeling. It's a great feeling that the temple that we go to, the Casa de Feja, we've just been given a new location. This Luke this new location has been more than just a gift because when we shared with another temple they have certain way of doing things and we have other ways of doing things of because the way we praise God we have a different way of doing it and now we're so free to to praise him in the way that we know, in the way that we were taught, in the way that we're being taught. Because my sister and her husband, the pastors of Casa de Fe, they learn every day, every day. They're learning about all kinds of stuff, you know. All kinds of stuff that they, that they learn that they watch, that they find out meanings of stuff and why this happens and how it happens, and so on and so forth. So that freedom is the same freedom that you get from your salvation. And this is uh, the pastor, Raymond Crespo. He's been speaking to us in English, his name is Raymond. Raymond Crespo. And he's been speaking to us. The Lord has been speaking through him like he does all the time on how, how faith, growth, becomes what guides you to whatever to whatever things that you need to to fix it's your faith 
It's believing that the Lord exists. It's believing that you can talk to him one-on-one and he listens to you and he'll answer you. That's <laughs> that's amazing. It's it's a great great feeling. Let's go to another verse. Let's see what we have. We have in the book of Luke chapter 3 verse 6. And it says And all flesh shall see salvation of God. All salvation. All all flesh. I'm sorry. And all flesh, flesh shall see salvation of God. He exists. And when he comes, whether you have accepted him or not, you will get a chance to see him and wonder why 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 didn't i believe that he exists why didn't i believe that he had the solution to my problem the book of acts chapter 4 verse 12 neither is there salvation in any other For there is none other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. Yeshua is the only one that can save you. Another man can't save you. A person with money can't save you. Only the Lord can save you from your sins. Only the Lord can help you to understand what we're supposed to do, what we were meant to do, what we were meant to be. We weren't meant to be slaves of the flesh. We weren't meant to hurt people. We weren't meant to destroy Everything that our Father has given us, Yahweh. Everything that He has given us, we weren't meant for that, unfortunately. Someone decided to do the opposite of what the Lord told them. Had they not touched what they weren't supposed to touch, and we would have been still in the garden with the reward of the Lord's presence we have his presence now but it would have been so much different I mean the Lord knows everything that you go through but you have to tell him what it is that you're going through he needs to hear it from your mouth I mean when 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 Yahweh was looking for Adam he's like hey Adam where are you he knew where he was he knew exactly where he was he knew exactly what he did but he just like he's giving us now he gives you the opportunity to tell the truth he gives you the opportunity to make choices and he makes us feel whether we do the right choice or the wrong choice he gives us that choice and that's wonderful that we're not being forced Yes, there's a heaven. Yes, there's a hell. And yes, you would want to choose to go to heaven. But no, you're not forced. You have the chance to be saved today. 
you have the chance to give the Lord the opportunity to change your life to make you feel wanted loved to feel that the family that you were missing has now been found with the love let's go to another verse we have the book of Romans chapter 1 verse 16 and it says for I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ for it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believeth to the Jew first and also to the Greek doesn't matter right now what race you are you could accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior and he will love us all the same love us all the same we're going to go back we're going to go for a commercial and we'll be right back Dios le bendiga esta es la pastora Diana Crespo invitándoles a que nos sintonices todos los miércoles a las 9 pm a tu programa Mujeres de Guerra Dios está sanando, liberando, levantando y restaurando las vidas, y Él quiere hacer lo mismo en tu vida. Escúchenos a través de radiofarodeluz.net. Les esperamos.
Salvation is the key word to my life and your life. For those who want to accept the Lord Jesus Christ as your Savior, I don't always get this right, but I do try. And it is the beginning before you find somewhere to go and someone to speak to more deep about salvation. So I'd like everybody to put their hand on their computer and repeat after me. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord, I pray that you may forgive me for my sins. I pray that you may help me understand what it is that I'm doing wrong. I pray, Lord, that you may save me. I pray, Lord, that you may guide me through my salvation step by step, Lord. Lord, I accept you as my Savior. I accept you as my Lord and Savior. And I pray that you will hear me and that you will show me the way. I ask you these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Now if you've said that, you're on the first step and you're getting closer to your salvation. If you have any questions, you know you can call us at 413-219-2647. Um, or if at any time you're anywhere in Holyoke or happen to pass through Holyoke, Casa de Fe Jaiwejire is located on 104 Suffolk Street, 
in Holyoke, Massachusetts. Find someone, find find the nearest temple, and and find out more about what we talk about every Friday, which is your salvation. And the Lord will not only reward you with His presence, will not only reward you with your salvation, but you'll be free. So we will leave this with a prayer. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, Lord, for this word, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, for your scriptures, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for your guidance. I thank you, Lord, for always being there for me and my family, Lord Jesus. I pray, Lord, for each and every person that has just accepted the Lord as their Savior. I pray, Lord, that you may touch their hearts, Lord. That you may open up their minds to what they want for eternity, Lord. I pray, Lord, for each and every person and their families. That you may bless them, Lord Jesus. And that they may feel your presence, Lord. That they may understand that you are the way. Like it says in John 3.16, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believe in him shall not perish but have an everlasting life thank you Lord for those beautiful words I ask you these things in Yeshua's name Amen we're going to commercial and we will be back in a few minutes hola el Ministerio Sobre Alas de Águila les invita los jueves desde 9 a 10 p.m. por Radio Faro de Luz punto net. Esta ha sido tu hermana y amiga, Rosa María Santiago. Radio Faro de Luz. Different time with the same stuff Feel like you go in a circle stuck in the same rut Want to be free from the bondage of unrestrained lust I know the feeling I've been there, I want the same cuffs I asked myself, is it possible when I came up That I couldn't share, so forgot where I came from But I'm not sure, so I play it safe, keep my name tucked And I go back to before the truth when I play drums Yeah, this life is so simple then Just me, a pair of sticks and a symbol stand Youth ministry, Uncle Mike was a simple stand of a righteousness teaching his life and about a simple plan. I discovered that life is so unpredictable. Who would have known it would go and get this difficult? Kids dig a hole, they dig a bigger hole. And the pain of life is so cyclical that all you want is Stuck in your old ways Feel like you always gonna be there Even in old age Can't even fuck no more Don't it feel like a tug of war Fight with this or afraid Cause it wasn't supposed to go this way You looking over your life Like how did I get here Why can't I get out This is my fifth year Stuck in the same pattern The wrong lifestyle Wings of an eagle But living life like a night owl Ow Dwelling in a dark place And you stumble and fall when you try to walk straight You need freedom from addiction to those that don't taste And freedom from all the stubborn habits that won't break Lord, please deliver me, literally I'm going back and forth I'm sick and tired of crying out on the bathroom floor I walk away for a minute, then I'm back for more Moment of peace, then it's back to war All I 
want to see. Here to offer you hope through all of your highs and lows. Might have proposed that with Jesus nothing's impossible. He can provide you with strength to get you through obstacles. He got the power to rescue and dig you out the hole. Give us a pot of gold for all the pride of goes. Throw your hands up and surrender and know that the Father knows. You on the winding road, but you are not alone. Hand up the keys and move over so he can drive you home. And do more than just give directions. He got the blood that'll cover up all your imperfections. He got the keys that'll set you free from your prison sentence. You can raise up because he specializes in resurrection. So give him praise and give him reverence. But sin is praise. It's in his presence. You find the joy in the strip that you need to make a change. Lift up your shackles, not a break of chains. All you need is To be J1. To be J1. I know a place where we will cry, but I'll wipe the tears from our eyes. All our fears will be alright, because only in Him are we alive. Oh, and I, I know a place when you reach the Look at this accomplishments and perfect sacrifice to appease God's wrath, to worship Him is right. There is no other way, they all lie. God sent His Son, and His Son died. Put your idols to the fire, let them burn. Christ resurrected, and He will return. God wrote the story, put Himself in it. Now you and Him can meet, it's the way that He intended. If you're looking for a place that can take away the hurting, looking for a place before your situation worsens, looking for a place where the freedom is for certain, looking for escape because the enemy is lurking. Should you join another church? Maybe you are sick and tired of searching, because it seems like nothing is working. I'm here to tell you that the place is in a person. I'm praying that you turn. You can have a brand new position in Christ. Forgiven. He is everything you need. Love, joy, hope, peace. Come rest, come rest in Him. In Him, let go. Let go. Amen.
Praise Break on JoinForceInternational.org with DJ Juan. The light of fire in thee, light up entire cities with the glory of God. I'm tripping, I'm standing all with me. All other all's are empty. Better make haste to the great taste of the great faith. Man, I got what y'all been missing. Now, so wait, you can feel it. Yo. This is more than music for waiting. This other savior can bury it. It can soon get that weight. Gotta wait to it. I'm waking you to God. That weight gotta wait to it. Come and see a man who died. Came alive. He's just a son of God. I'm on the dotty. Should be on the top of my little eyes. I'm talking, looking, I look to the book to put the light. And you can see glory. You just born. You got to kill me. It feel like fire in me, feel the light of fire in thee Light up entire cities with the glory of God, I'm tripping I'm standing all with me, all other all's are empty Better make haste to the great taste of the great faith Man, I got what y'all been missing Now, so wait, you can feel it, y'all This is more than music for waiting This other savior can marry it And so we get that weight, got a weight to it I'm waking you to God, that weight got a weight to it Come and see a man who died Dreaming came alive, and he's just a son of God I'm on the dot, he should be on the top of my little eyes I'm talking, looking, I look to the book, the book of life And you can see glory, you just born, you got nothing to me For your joy, I'm on some other world But they satisfy you, homie, you gon' need another world See, it is a killer vanity, we'll leave you smother, girl Death the cause, medics to come wrap you in a cover, girl Yeah, yeah. Wait in glory And then thirst, it exists and all of us try to quench it But getting stuff for stuff has never been enough It's only an ad and I trust in the son's sacrifice You ain't gotta stay thirsty, those ackies will comply If we got a sip of this bit that lives in water The world will interest in man is Jesus, he's the author They find a comical, I make music to prove them wrong Life isn't breathing, life is no God I get on mission, that mission is my vision They see the sun is splendid, if I know this it will eclipse it This is the scripture, I feast on Christ and get so fat off of God's poor sin Everybody get in the 
the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a hand in the air. Everybody in the building, everybody got a We all want it, yeah. We all need it. We all want it, yeah. We all need it.
still living in bondage, not knowing the problem was not just my pride and lust, but that life was so autonomous. But at epiphany, I had an epiphany, realizing community was the way it was meant to be. In the beginning, he who gave us identity was eternally coexisting as a trinity. It's not good that man should be alone, it's impossible for him to model us on his own. He gave man a companion, not a clone, command and reproduction, expansion of the throne. The new Adam is starting it all over, walking it with a bride who glorifies Jehovah. You want to know who you are, then know your own, cause your ID. Ambassadors chopping Puff that milk to me Having all things in common Before church planting was an option Before those albums started dropping We were in communities stomping Patient with your boy when I was loud and obnoxious Before I turned my life up at a concert Before I knew truth over nonsense Before I hit the stage they were cautious Accountability, awesome Not to produce a man selfish or pompous Know the process, I learned the scriptures in its context Bible studies, yeah, sometimes they made me nauseous But I never get sick of spitting up these synoptics constantly Keeping others up on my conscience, being honest, not just robbing them of the knowledge. Promise to serve one another, right conduct. It might be common since I'm a communist. Yeah. Back, back, the church voice. Yeah. 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 The new life is Let's 
nation, he returns as the lion with the mic. He runs the earth jungle, crush my burden to the law. Free the fire that I send, got death in the flow. Demonstrate the power over death, over sickness, over nature, over evil, over time, over distance. All power in his hands, and when they thought he was ruling, he rose from the grave like How are you there? He established the church, working hard like adrenaline. When Satan in the world, they wanna pump us and riddle it. Gotta keep running in your base till you're simple and perseverance to the saints, baby, there's no giving in. Now the Holy Spirit provides gifts for the church so we can build one another, complete his work. What does it say about Jehovah? He's so consistent. Man falls, man repents, man free from his prison. All by his power through his mercy and his grace. But we can stop worshiping self and seek his face. We live the great commandment and we do the great commission. So we see 2020 continue to fail business. Business. We're always choosing misery because we haven't planned to say no to that second helping, or that drink, or that look into a magazine, or getting out of bed in the morning, and so we surrender in the moment to the God of the could have been why I should have listened to the prophet But your little homie told you you should try it For you knock it and you did it You got with it and it felt so microscopic That's until you tried to quit it And you felt you couldn't stop it Slave now, addicted to the rush That's what you crave now, can I get enough? You're a Christian on a mission And a battle here is tough And the matter that you grapple with Is battling with lust, I know Just took another peek into the magazine Put another finger in the Vaseline Flush was on fire, gave it gasoline and this is just a battle for the average team <laughs> And every human with a beating heart Every Christian struggles, but we pressing just to meet them all Supernatural powers running through us because we need to spark But we can't determine if we Spider-Man or Peter Park <laughs> And I'm confused now, which one is it? Losers, are we winners? Are we saints or are we sinners? And I'm trying to figure out if we victims or we victors But I guess it all depends on what you cooking up for dinner they say you is what you eatin' and you really love God You been shining like a beacon and you silent You got knowledge, you been walking in your freedom And you faithful through the week, but you be fighting on the weekends <laughs> I know the Christian life's a struggle now Friday night is popping in the city like it's buzzing now <laughs> about, 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 I'm used to call out for another round <laughs> Got to do you swing life in the underground Feel like you owe it to yourself, don't you? Feel it's magnetic when it pulls you Trying to pull away when it keeps pushing And you want it bad, but you know it's poison like my God, I feel so powerless Crying out to heaven, saying, Jesus, I know I'm a mess Looking at the hours left, Jesus, get me out of this Cause you know we lose it if we try to fight in our own strength <laughs> Screaming, God, save me, God, save me I know I gotta die daily, die daily If I need deliverance from gluttony and fine ladies I know I'm winning with the strip that God gave me This power's running through my veins Change if I want to change. Temptations drive me insane. Uh, welcome to the Hunger Games. Uh, shit, you winning, man, you winning, man. Victory in Jesus and you striven in the inner man. Here we hear from Jesus when we playing down at Winter Jam. Cause we wanna help him to come up with a preventive plan. Yeah, preparation is the key. I'm on my diet just to make it through the weekend, man. I know that all my strength is gonna be based on what I eat. So then if I deny my belly, then I'm faithful when I'm weak, I'm gone. You are listening to DJ One on JoinForceInternational.org. You are listening to DJ One. You are listening to DJ One. Take a break to praise with Praise Break on JoinForceInternational.org with DJ One. 
Uh-huh. Yeah. Talk so about putting on sin, man. Yes, sir. And putting on Jesus Christ. You know what I'm talking about? Uh-huh. Colossians 3, baby. I'm Mr. Evan Crespo, and, and we, we want, want to invite, invite you to our program, program, What's the Word? A kids program that teaches kids, teens, and adults the Word of God. 
So tune in every Wednesday from 8.30 to 9 p.m. to watch us live on DJ1 TV on bamboozer.com, LUG TV online on joinforceinternational.org, and on Roku Player, Uniendo Fuerzas Internacionalmente. God bless.
Head is barely operable. It's got your brain loading when they go in here. It's got to go. When you awake, walking and talking to be an obstacle. It's hard to feel hope right in your will in 27 years. Oh, but you never said I'm too young for this. Not a mumble and grumbling word on your tongue and lips. Like God, why? Lift up your chin and pump your fist like all these years of loving him. And this is what I get. You know I had to cry. Looking in your eyes instead in your life and death. Christ will be glorified. This muscle in my chest is broken, leaking, but I'm in Jesus. But something's underneath me, a heart that never stops. Be Found it was surgical that the thing affecting her airports was terminal. I can see the devastation on her parents' faces. Your baby girl has a bad heart and it needs replacement. Born this way, we can't medicate it. Somebody has to die with a good heart, then we'll exchange it. Some sort of substitute. But she won't survive time, you in real time. Yeah, she needs a savior. But she had one in 14 and went down. Heart transplant, so this one would be the second round. But this procedure isn't near as crucial as the first. Cause this new heart will stop beating even if it works. She didn't dwell on all the stuff that she would never be. If I don't get picked from this list, eternal joys ahead of me. The nurse said she's in denial, that's why she keeps a smile. No, she hoped to God, and the donor came at the right time. Yeah, that's why you hear her singing now. <laughs> what the answer is, but I know what the answer isn't, it can't be that he doesn't care or he's non-existent, suffering's a problem and why many are rejecting God, but just cause you don't know the answer doesn't mean there isn't one, but if God's plan for pain isn't for you to skip it, we need the nightmare to appreciate not being in it, deeper the pain, deeper the gain, the bonus in it, plus God will check out so serious, he joined us in it, Jesus suffered like another when he was on the cross, why do the good die? That only happened once, but the good prize, but not for good guys. He gives through hearts and eternal life to the ones who should die. He gives our pain purpose, this is not in vain. We endure, enjoy, but enjoy seeing his face. <laughs> It'll all make sense then. Here's the suffering made up for in the instant. This may be the last breath that I take, but it's okay. It's fine by me. But as I get to know her, the more I find out, no matter what happens, she has a heart that will never stop beating. Love it. Yeah. 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 Check us out. Every Friday night on Joint Force International dot org. This this DJ one. Radio Faro de Luz. Radio Faro de Luz.
Take a break to praise with DJ Wan.
Massachusetts on the Joint Force International dot org radio internet broadcast out in Spring Hill, Florida. So join me every Friday night from 10 p.m. to 12 a.m. 